Measuring Datasets Using Thresholding in Metamorph NX. This video proceeds through the steps of making measurements on your experimental images using thresholding. Before we make our measurements, we open our dataset. Metamorph NX makes measurements on one dataset at a time. Measurements are stored in a database with the datasets. You must display the images to be analyzed. If multiple image windows are shown in the image grid, all of the images will be analyzed. All functions related to measurements are found on the measurement ribbon accessed through the Measure tab. There are three types of measurements offered in Metamorph NX version 1. These types are measure regions, measure using threshold, and count nuclei. As shown here, each has its own advantages. In this movie, we will use measure using threshold. This technique is useful when you want to analyze specific structures on one or more images and the specific structures can be identified based upon their gray value range. This technique assumes that the gray values in the objects are different from the background, so this technique does not work well with images that have uneven backgrounds. This function does work with both light objects on a dark background, like fluorescence, or dark objects on a light background, like transmitted light. Since you are using thresholding to segment the images, many morphometric and intensity measurements are available. Assuming that the image or images of interest are being displayed, select Measure Using Threshold from the measurement types. Configure measurement parameters by either highlighting the Measure Using Threshold choice or clicking the Configure button. The configuration options for measure using threshold are the specific channel to use, the standard area value for measurement, the threshold range, whether to include what is between the limits or outside of the threshold limits. You also have options to exclude any of the objects identified if they touch the image edge and to fill holes in objects. Choose what images are to be measured. During configuration, we chose which channel was to be measured. In this step, we configure whether it is all time, all Z, and or all stage positions. Remember, as we have said previously, whether or not you choose any of these options, measurements will be made on all of the images displayed in the image grid. Finally, make the measurements. You can start the measurements by clicking on the Measure button in the Measure Using Threshold Configuration dialog or the icon in the Measure ribbon. As the measurements are made, a green progress bar will go from left to right. When the measurement is completed, a new Measure Using Threshold measurement set will appear in the list of measurements. The measurement set can be reviewed or transferred to Excel. For more information about these procedures, please see the movie entitled Reviewing Measurement Data.